It's 650 pesos per month per policeman, Your Honor. 650 pesos? Opo. Lang? 20 kilos so, per policeman, Your Honor. Per so, wala pa isang kaban yun. So, how much is one kaban of rice? 2,000? Baka naman pwede less, natin. Uh, Baka naman pwede natin. Pang isa pang... Baka pwede naman natin dagdagan na gawin uh, 50 kilos isang buwan. Kakayanin ba? We'll look into that, Your Honor. At the appropriate time. How is this rice subsidy allowance given? Monthly? Quarterly? Or... Monthly, Your Honor. Monthly. 650 pesos. Apa. Gano'n na po katagal na itong rice subsidy allowance na binibigay po sa ating kapulisan. When did this start? Began during the previous administration, Your Honor. The start of uh, the term of Apo. former President Duterte. Apo. And it's and it is being continued okay, right Magaling now. ho yung cheap PNP nung panahon na yan, sir. Mm. Yeah, I, I believe so and I agree with you. Mm. Okay, 790,764,000 is appropriated for personal service, which shall include the regular pay and allowances of the uniformed personnel of the IAS. How many PNP uniformed and non-uniformed personnel are assigned to the IAS? Yes. Because as per PNP Internal Affairs Service Guidelines and Procedures, uniformed personal strength is maintained at 1,000. And civilian employees are maintained at 297. Do we still maintain this number? Ah, okay. There are 806, Your Honor. 806? So, kulang? Kulang yung alin po. Kasi based, because of... Uh, Based on the, as per the PNP Internal Affairs Service Guidelines and Procedures, uniform personal strength is maintained at 1,000 and civilian employees are maintained at, at 297. So, ilan yun sinabi niyo po? 800? 806. Okay. So, what is the current case resolution efficiency of yes of the ES? <laughs> hundred percent, Your Honor. There's no pending case. There's no pending case. Malapit. Very good. So, gano po kabilis o kabaga o kabaga lang isang uh, ES case against an erring uh, police official. <laughs> Uh, Your Honor, they say the fastest resolution is around a month. And then the pag medyo complicado yung kaso, three to four months. Oh. Three yeah. to four months. Opo. So right now, there is no pending case before Wala the po. yes. Okay. Uh, I have mentioned to the Chief PNP, Chief PNP uh, several weeks ago that there is a certain policeman who was, uh, was assigned, uh, I don't know, as Chief of... Uh, for custodial when we were still uh, incarcerated together with uh, Senator uh, Bong. And uh, this police official has been uh, visiting us without, I, do, I never knew this uh, policeman he kept visiting us and uh, asking for favors and uh, of course uh, i together with uh, senator bong uh, gave in to all his uh, favors and uh, 
when and, and when he was assigned to head the uh, custodial center he never showed up and in fact this skalawag this policeman i will ne i will not mention his name i, I think uh, the chief pnp yes this police officer never showed up and in fact began his uh, power tripping he never he never allowed our lawyers to enter our our uh, uh, inside the premises of of the jail and you know and you and i know that lawyers are uh, allowed to visit uh are are allowed to visit us 24 hours even our immediate families even uh, uh priests whatever but this this police officer never allowed our lawyers to enter the, our premises so what can you say uh Arang, Mr. Chair? initially without, without even conferring with the chief pnp right? that seems to be a violation of your uh, human rights your honor uh but I was told, Your Honor, that that policeman, if we're talking about the same one, is already stationed in the barn, Your Honor, sa Cotabato City Hall. I hope he will not be given that opportunity to be promoted, if ever that time comes. Well, certainly we share with you the sentiment. Yeah. If there are, uh, if there is a, any deprivation of uh, uh, your rights or anyone's rights, for that matter, that should be reflected in the record of uh, the officer, Your Honor. Yun lang po pagkikusap sa inyo. Mr. Chief PNP. And anyway, going back to the rice uh, subsidy allowance. No? If we are going to increase the rice subsidy allowance to 1,000 pesos per month, PNP will be needing additional more or less 80 million pesos. No? Uh, tama po ba ako, Mr. Chair? Nothing kayo bigay? Eh, pagka kayo po ang nag-request, eh, syempre, well, na mapipilitan mo tayo mag uh, so, hanap ng pondo. At the proper time, maybe in the period of amendments, we will just uh, increase the uh, rice subsidy allowance of all the members of uh, the police force. Because yes, Your Honor. that is what my uh, father, when he was president, did to the uh, soldiers, the members of uh, the military meron silang actually meron silang isang kabaw na bigas monthly that's why i want to expand it na na masama rin yung ating mga kapulisan that is well taken your honor we will the committee will work with you to find ways and means your honor so with that uh, i do not have any other questions uh, mr chair thank you maraming salamat uh, your honor uh, to senator jingoy and for his concern for our uh, men in uniform and uh, again may commitment po sa See si Chief PNP Sakanya regarding the matter he brought up. Thank you, Your Honor. Thank you, Mr. President. Thank you, uh, Senator Jengoy. Pro probably with uh, with this indulgence, probably can include also the, the men in, and women, men in uniform of uh, the BJMP and the uh, Bureau of Fire as well, with the uh, PNP personnel. Next to uh, Thank you, Your Honor. Thank you, Mr. Next President. to interpolate is our minority leader, Senator Coco Pimentel. Yes, we.